How did Ted Williams spend five years of his prime in the military and still have a 19 year Hall of Fame baseball career? At 22 years old in 1941, Ted Williams led the MLB with a 406 batting average. Then in 1942, he won the Triple Crown with the highest batting average, most home runs, and most RBIs. But back during May of that 1942 season, he was sworn into the Navy to be a pilot during World War II. And when the baseball season ended, he was called into active duty. Williams then missed the next three baseball seasons. And instead, he was serving in the military. Williams had no experience being a pilot, but he worked incredibly hard and finished at the top of his class in flight school. And that led to him being a second lieutenant in the Marine Corps. After the war, he returned to the Red Sox in 1946. In his first season back, he won the MVP. And over the next six seasons, he was an all-star every year. But the story doesn't stop there. In 1952, at 33 years old, he rejoined the Marines during the Korean War. As a captain, he flew in 39 combat missions over the next two years. Then he came home and dominated baseball again. 